I'm in Rock Hill hometown to USC football superstar Jadavian Clowney. Now those who grew up with the six foot six, 275 pound defensive end say they knew the moment he stepped onto this field, he was a man playing a boys game and he was meant to make history. It was in the summer of 2007 that coach Bobby Carroll was caught off guard by a towering stranger. He uh, came into the weight room. We kind of looked at him and thought maybe, you know, he's just a, an adult that's lost and uh, walking through a, a, a school. But Jadave and Clowney was just beginning high school and already he was no stranger to victory on the sports field. When he was about six or seven playing small fry and people were saying that he was bigger than everybody else and he was going to be good. Growing up, his mother made sure to challenge her son with different sports and that, she says, helped keep him out of trouble. We, we don't live in the best of neighborhoods in Rocky, even though now it's a lot it's a lot better when he when he was growing up than it was when I was growing up. My whole family stays on the same street, really. My mom and dad is like two houses away from us. It wasn't long into his high school career that he caught the eye of college coaches. His three years of really being recruited, uh, getting letters and stuff from colleges, you could probably fill a, a dump truck twice with it. Despite his local fame, the national attention that followed as Clowney signed with USC in 2011 surprised those closest to him. Uh, people on my job start saying, you're starting number one in the country. And I'm like, you know, I didn't know what that meant because uh, I wasn't into stats and football like I am now. Uh, you know, I've seen him hold babies and get his picture made, you know, just like a president or something. Those who have watched his rise don't doubt the best is yet to come. You know, he'll be a, a top pick in the NFL draft and, you know, it'll be 20 or something million dollars the first, the first contract. You always want better for your kids than what I have. In Rock Hill, PJ Randawa, WIS News 10.